We've just spoken to the teams before they've come into this lunchtime park Ferme at Mount Pleasant. They've just done 41 kilometres of some real high speed, shy roads, hard packed, big commitment needed. After this service, they're actually going to do another three stages before we go to the super stage at Gawler tonight. <laughs> going to plan a little overshoot though in the last one over here. Yeah, just um, there's a fast section. Again, I keep saying this fast section, there's plenty of them, but this time we're at sort of 185, 190 for oh, maybe 20 seconds and then a crest into a 70 metre junction and just hit the brakes and we're way too deep in. So just barrier it off just with some uh, tape and stuff, just went straight through it. <laughs> About 30 or 40 metres past it today. Pretty poor handbrake turn. <laughs> Didn't really turn very well, and then I uh, had to go through our dust and back on the stage. So lost a bit of time, but uh, you know the guys, Molly and Stephen, they they've upped the pace again, so they keep me pretty honest. Molly, a stage win there, and only 10 off the lead. Uh, pretty much be pretty pleased with the pace, but lots of things to consider with the uh, the last stages this afternoon coming. Yeah, we've just been you know trying to do more of the same and. Um, those stages I found really, really tricky. They're um, very difficult to judge because you're, you're in six gear so much time and the, the roads that look really, really wide, but actually the line you, you need to be on is very precise. So, um, yeah, it was really challenging those uh, few stages, but we just tried to keep it neat and tidy and it seemed to work. Steve McKenzie uh, lost a little bit out in there, but you're still in the mix here. Top three still and not too far away from Molly. Yeah, yeah we struggled to, um, I guess, find a groove in uh, that 18K stage. Yeah, just uh, had a few moments in there and yeah, really struggled, uh, but uh, we lost 10 seconds, so we're still seven or so off Molly, so um, we'll be having a big push this Arvo to try and get this uh, heat on her, yeah. yeah. I'm not sure how everybody else is going, but I, I think the biggest issue we've got to work on with this car at the moment is actually getting traction. Yeah, it's got plenty of power and, and plenty of go and we're, we're pushing it along pretty well. Losing a little bit of time here or there with the odd silly mistake, but um, it's just not on the pace and I, and I get the feeling it's, it's traction. Big pattern just as I walked up to you said the old plan didn't work, tell them what got back by. Look, we, uh, we were sort of sitting you know, behind the Walkhams and thought, well, it's nearly all or nothing sort of thing, and we thought let's go out on hards on those stages, hoping that the temperature would be a little bit harder. They, they went out on mediums, and a few of the other guys in four drives went out on mediums, and second on the road on hards was just the slipperiest ordeal ever, and, yeah, unfortunately took a fair bit of time out of us. But, uh, look, you know, we've got our good three rounds already, so um, that was the, the plan of attack. But, anyway, you can only try. It could have gone the other way where it might have worked enough over really but uh, yeah it's we're, we're sort of in that position now we have to try and do something a little bit different or we're just going to trail along for the rest of the uh, afternoon and tomorrow so we came out with a defined plan this morning we just wanted to keep uh, Mick on a string and uh, make sure that we could uh, keep a safety buffer between here and ourselves and uh, so far it's worked are you having a slow Marcus down speed him up anyway or he's pretty under control because you're quite new to the caper as well truth be said well, look, that showed out in that stage. Um, going through those three fast stages with a lot of commitment, you could make up a lot of time, but uh, we're new on notes. Mark's driving them and me reading them, so we, we took it quite easy and then used the power of the car as appropriate. Stage win on the opening run, which would have made you small. Uh, 12 behind overall, so still plenty to play for. Yeah, yeah, we're still in the hunt, and um, in the second stage we, we had a spin, or else I think we would have been right on their pace in that one as well. So positive things going into this afternoon. Um, Trial Hill was, you know, a pretty intimidating sort of a stage. I've never never competed on roads quite that fast before, so it was an eye-opener and it was a, a, a strong first attempt and it's nice to get my eye in here and, you know, it's, I'm sure it's a rally I'll come back to in the future, so it's nice to be learning these shy roads. Awesome the times through there. You must have been loving it. Yeah, look, it's getting better, mate. Um, we've, we've sort of fixed that slow speed issue we had through the tight corners um, and now we're just chasing a bit of high-speed grip, but... Um, I think it's, yeah, now 75% me, 25% the car. I've just got to find some confidence and, and commit to the notes and, and get there. But, yeah, certainly getting a bit better.